Hey, what's good guys? This is Nightwing2303 from Wartesters.com. Today we have a quick look at the Under Armour Fire Shot. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get right into it. All right guys, so here they are. This is the navy and gold colorway. A couple of people in the unboxing video of this shoe here was telling me that this is the Notre Dame colorway. So if that's true, that's awesome. They got some really sick colors. This is the mid slash high top version of the shoe. There will be a low top as well. It doesn't have this huge like comp fit upper. But if you're into the whole placebo thing, then this might be a good look for you. Now, as far as the tech specs are concerned, we've got this uh, traction pattern here that I don't know what it is. It just looks kind of like shattered glass or whatever. And then the rim here is actually herringbone. I think they probably should have just used herringbone throughout just because this looks sketchy, but it also feels like a nice, like kind of like tacky rubber. The feeling of it reminds me of like the Air Jordan 3 and those had really good traction despite how it looked so these might actually have the same thing uh, plus dust won't be too much of an issue here because it's all flat so it'll just push the dust away instead of dust clogging the traction and becoming like a dry mop on your shoe so traction looks sketchy but might perform really good cushion is micro G and it feels amazing this is not my size these are going to Brian if you're interested in following him all you got to do is hit that link in the description box below or you can go ahead and just follow weartesters.com because either way that's where the review is going to be posted the performance review that is so i'm not sure how they how they feel as far as sizing goes but um as far as the the cushion they felt really good and then i can't pull the insole out but inside it's a yellow ortholite like it's the foam itself is yellow and then this interior here is really nicely sculpted and stuff so it's it doesn't have the um the heel notches per se but it's very sculpted so it's going to fit around your heel and your Achilles just fine. And you got that mesh tongue and then the upper here is just kind of all synthetic. It just reminds me of Fuse but there are sections of open mesh and the mesh is glued on top of it. Some of it's very legit where it's just very breathable right there. You could literally just blow air right through it and then some of it's completely solid so uh, some of it's useful, some of it's just an upper. And then you have this uh, synthetic toe rand right here as well that's made out of fuse. And that's for durability and uh, protection of the, the materials itself. So these retail for, I think they were like 120 or something like that. And uh, in my opinion, I think they could be a little bit cheaper, but again, there's gonna be a low top version as well. That one will probably be a little bit cheaper than these. However, this is one of their only shoes of Micro G. So if you are not liking the charge cushion, I don't not like it, but I don't love it like I do Micro G. So this would be a shoe that I'd probably be like, oh man, I'm gonna go and grab these if I was interested in one of Under Armour's upcoming models. Especially knowing that there's gonna be a low top because that low top of this colorway, or not of this colorway, but of this shoe looks sick. So again, I'm gonna be sending these over to um, uh, Duke or Brian however you know him and uh, if you're interested in the performance review make sure that you follow him and follow weartesters.com because that's where it'll be posted as soon as he gets them give him about a week or so to get them all tested and then he will post a review thank you guys for watching thanks for all your support let me know what you guys think of the fire shot anybody play with them I know that this is a new team shoe so a lot of the high school teams are gonna be wearing this shoe on court as well as a lot of the collegiate teams so if you do wear this shoe on court leave your thoughts on them in the comment section below. Thank you guys again, and until next time, have a good one.